Hello friend, welcome to my channel 5 Minute Pediatric. Few days back, I posted a question on Facebook. The question was related to 9 month female child with grade 2 malnutrition came to us with abnormal movement of finger. This movement is disappeared during sleep. Uh, blood is investigation showing severe macrocytic anemia. Uh, EEG showing high eye voltage and uh, sharp spikes. CT brain showing cortical atrophy. The child was dull looking and having expressionless face with hypopigmented hair. So what is the diagnosis and uh, uh, what would be the treatment? So any movement which gets get disappeared during sleep uh, and occurring in uh, distal part of the limb. So this is uh, tremor. So this child is having tremor with severe macrocytic anemia and the child is malnourished. So this condition is uh, commonly seen in poor socioeconomic status, the condition what we call infantile tremor syndrome. So this is a clinical syndrome having acute or gradual onset with mental and psycho so, uh, psychomotor changes. There is pigmentary disturbances of uh, skin and hair, pallor and the tremor in maladies child. The age group is between five months to three years. So the classical picture, what we get, the child is plump and pale looking. The age group as we defined six to 18 months, having multiple sign of malnutrition. This child usually listless, apathic, expressionless, and having no interest in the surrounding. A scalp hair is sparse and light color. Uh, you may get hyperpigmented over the knuckle, uh, a very fold buttocks, Tremor having acute onset following acute infection or stress. It may be initially intermittent but continuous uh, later on. Now you may, uh, which are these tremor are mostly uh, prominent in distal part of the limb, head, face, and tongue. And uh, tremors usually disappear during sleep. You may get a regression of the milestone in the present past. So what is the etiology? Uh, so the etiology is not clearly defined. Uh, there are various theory available, but the nutritional theory is most ac uh, accepted. Other theory uh, include uh, viral uh, encephalitis or degenerative process, they might be. Uh, but nutritional theory is most accepted. There are various several nutritional deficiencies, but most common is vitamin B12 deficiency. This child usually uh, are exclusively breastfeed or uh, mother is exclusively vegetarian. There is a low level of vitamin B12 found in both uh, baby and mother. Other nutritional deficiency include iron, uh, magnesium and zinc deficiency may also cause ITS. There are several uh, indirect or indirect evidence uh, suggestive for other nutritional deficiency like protein and fat soluble vitamins and other micronutrients. So what are the clean, uh, diagnostic uh, criteria? There is no definite diagnostic criteria. This condition is diagnosed clinically and few lab uh, supportive evidence. We have peripheral smear having anemia, mostly uh, megaloblastic or macrocytic anemia with hyperpigmented neutrophil. In bone marrow, you may get megaloblastic picture. If you go for uh, vitamin B12 level, you may get uh, low. Uh, if, uh, Similarly, uh, in the increased urinary level of methyl malonic acid, these all suggest B12 deficiency. In CSF, you may get B12, uh, decreased B12 level and transcarbamine 2. Um, if we go for vitamin uh, B12, let's say in mother, you may get low. So there is a uh, decreased level in breast, also, breast milk also. Serum level of zinc, ascorbic acid, and magnesium is also found to be low in case of ITS. Commonest finding in CT and MRI is cortical atrophy uh, and the prominence of subraconoid space and ventricular system. So now what are the treatment options we have? So the treatment is mostly supportive treatment. We have to treat anemia and we have to supplement uh, multiple nutrient like vitamin B12 and multivitamin, vitamin C, iron protein, zinc and magnesium. Uh, for tremor, we uh, have phenobarbitone. Uh, other option, we have propanolol and uh, chlorpromazine. Uh, usually, pigmented changes takes uh, pigmented changes in hair and skin takes months to clear. 
mental awareness and selfness uh, takes year to become normal so this is uh, all about uh, infantile tremor syndrome generally found in low socioeconomic status you may get multiple cases of infantile tremor syndrome so do not confuse it with seizure uh, hope you so enjoyed this video kindly like subscribe and follow my channel thanks thanks